Our first guest is a small business owner, a local politician, and oh, also one of the members of the most influential bands in the world, Fish. Please welcome to our show, John Fishman. Yeah. Yeah. Welcome. Thank you very much for coming. It is such a delight to have you on our show. Thank you. Uh, of course. So uh, the the band uh, Fish. You guys have a have a connection to Maine. Um, I was not at the show, but I heard stories that you, you played in, in my hometown of Old Town, Maine, in a place called the Penny Post, years and years and years ago. And then fast forward to this, these giant festivals in limestone. Um, what, what does Maine mean to you as, as a resident, but also somebody that spent so much time here with the band? Well, it's, it's my home now. And uh, the memories from, uh, from the festivals are incredible. And it's been funny since moving here, I realize that the whole state knows our band probably more than more than more than our our home state of Vermont uh, because and people would say oh oh you're that band well oh, we couldn't get beer for a week because uh, you know <laughs> so and it's funny because the most of people I met that know know of us they, they, it's not because they listen to the music it's they you know, they know about it from, from that situation so sure. So, uh, so Maine, Maine is your home now. Uh, you are involved uh, very much in your community. You're a small business owner, but also a, uh, a local selectman. What, what got you involved in politics? Uh, as probably most local, we were just talking, I was just talking with the selectman from uh, Dedham back there, and, and as most selectmen. <laughs> we're a hub for yeah, selectmen we, in the yeah, state. <laughs> we, it was probably as uh, most of us, we get roped into it uh, by uh, friends and family. and. Uh, so well, you would be a good person to, you know, well, there's an opening and you should run and, and then, oh, I'll look into it. And, <clears throat> and then the next thing you know, you're, you're, the, you're responsible for spending the town's money resp <laughs> responsibly. And if anything goes wrong, you get, you get yelled at. It's really a rock, between a rock and a hard place the whole time. It's like being a parent for a town. <laughs> yeah. And there's, everyone's a teenager. <laughs> That sounds delightful. It, 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 no, no, but I, I, do, I do love it. It's a great way to get to know your town. It's truly public service. Uh, it's, and it's humbling in that way. It's good. Was, was that your first uh, entry into uh, political activity? No. As you might know, and it's probably, I've, you know, people have criticized me, but I was a huge supporter of Bernie Sanders during the uh, last election. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, I was asked by the Sanders people to participate in um, uh, getting people signed up to vote and all that kind of stuff, and so I got out there and did that as much as I could uh, personally. And there was I had this one great day. I played. I sat in with I think twelve bands or nine bands in twelve hours from Portland to Fort Kent. Wow, <laughs> that's and cool. And it was all a big sit in and to get people to sign up and and. Uh, yeah, it was good. It was a good day. I met a lot of musicians in Maine that day. That's nice. Being yeah. able to blend politics and music like that, that's, uh, that's a lot of fun. Because I feel like politics can be so divisive, but music brings everyone together, so it's, almost, it's a wash, really. That is exactly the reason that the band I'm in doesn't get into the political arena. Mm -hmm. Because it, amongst my bandmates, there's, a, there's always been debate about this. And... Um, I'm kind of the activist in the group, although everybody is pretty active in their own ways, mm -hmm. but more uh, in, a, in private ways. And uh, I really wanted to do a Bernie Sanders benefit, but the band was like exactly what you said. It was, it's politics is divisive, music supposed to bring people together. We, there has to be a place for art for the sake of art. And I do agree with that mm -hmm. at the end of the day as well. And so as a little mini democracy, the bad the band is. I'm the odd man out there, but but uh, but it's okay. I can live with it because I do I do agree with that sentiment at its heart.